Al, am I right? Yes. Okay, the international bronze winner of the contest. Um, the, the just, the, 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 the just passed one that was held in what, 2017? 2017, yes. Right, so we have the 2017 international bronze winner here with us, Adrija Pal. So, um, you're welcome, guys. Thank you very much, Sandy. Thank you. Um, so, what is the DCAC all about? Well, just as you mentioned, the DCAC is one of the largest global art contests for children. Um, Toyota Motors Corporation, our manufacturer, has made it its, its prime aim mm -hmm. to bring together children and to garner their, their skill of art. Mm -hmm. What we want them to, to look out for is to create something that can be created to help solve future problems. Um, as you know, kids come from a very clear, clear perspective of what happens in the world and they see things differently. Mm. So what we are doing is that we are putting together all their thoughts, all their ideas in, into one artwork that depicts a problem or a challenge for society and how they feel those challenges can be solved within a society. Okay, so it's basically something like um, they are imagining how those will be solved and then they put that into art. Exactly. Right, and it has to be on a the theme of mobility. Yes, so future mobility. Future mobility. All right, so how long has the competition been running? Well, at the international level, this is the 12th time the international contest is going to be held. Mm. Um, we joined in 2008. So it's been like um, eight years um, since it eight to ten years since we joined the international contest yeah okay so to enter the competition this time round, are there any age limits to entry well yes there are age limits um, we are limiting it to um, children basically within the primary the primary level mm -hmm. and some children also fall within the first year of the senior secondary school system okay. so we are looking at children be, be below the ages of eight mm -hmm. and then eight to eleven and then twelve to fifteen all right, and um, you know, to register for this competition, how do you do it? Is there any fee as well? Well, <laughs> to enter, it's, it's free. All you have to do is to pick up a form. And we there are two modes in which um, you can pick up a form. You can pick up a form from um, Toyota head office at Graphic Road, or your your child or the parents mm. could actually also pick up a form from the school. That's if your, your school has registered with us to be part of this, um, this contest. Uh, you can also submit so once you pick up a form there are two ways to submit the form either you do it through bulk entries to the selected school okay. or you can also submit individually at the head office of Toyota Ghana. okay so what do participants stand to benefit from the contest um, are there any prizes well there are lots of prizes to be won from the Toyota dream car art contest and mm -hmm. um, the first prize itself is making your child very innovative and creative of what they do um, the second level is that at a, in, at a national context, we receive over, over let's say, 900 entries a year. Last year, we received over um, 982 entries alone. In Ghana? In Ghana, yes. Mm. What we do is that we invite 100 of the participants whose artworks are selected based on you know, the, the criteria that we set. And then we have a national award for all of them. At the national award, everybody gets a prize. Okay. And even those who do not come to the national award also get prizes. But the main prizes are for three uh, participants for each category. Okay. So making nine. What we do is that we send these nine artworks to Japan. And these nine artworks are vetted along with children from all over the world as well. And then they, they pick a gold, either a gold, silver, bronze or a special award for such entries and we are very happy that um, last year at the 11 dream car art contest mm -hmm. we were fortunate enough to be chosen as one of the winners for the international contest okay, and so, also so beyond that, was that the international bronze winner yes okay. yes beyond that not everybody who goes to the international contest actually wins an award so i'll do your power from over 830,000 children selected all all over the world had a chance to win the international bronze contest within her category okay so congratulations to Adri Japal. Uh, I'll Thank ask you. you. I'll ask you some questions here. I see your um, your certificate, and then I see your entry as well. Uh, very beautiful, very elaborate, and detailed. How do you feel? Um, I'm feeling very happy. Okay. 
And uh, how did you get to know about uh, the DCAC? Well, uh, I got to know about DCAC from like my school announced it and on the new notice board. Like my mother saw it, she told me like I was interested. So then I started uh, participating from then. Okay, so your artwork got the chance to win a fully sponsored trip to Japan and an international bronze award. What was the theme of the artwork? My artwork was a Toyota Transformer. Mm. So it's a car and there's a group of scientists inside it who take DNA from bad people and they convert it into good DNA in the laboratory, in the lab inside the car. So uh, when the bad people get back that good DNA, they become good people. So then good things start happening you know, on the earth. How, where did you get this idea from? Well, like I know like about all like the wars which are happening right mm. now and mm. all that have happened so i got this idea because of, i also know about dna okay. i learned about it all right so um how was your experience in japan last year well last year in japan it was very fun because i met a lot of people new people from various countries around 30 countries and also i got to see some interesting places in japan including a shinto and buddhist temple and I also went to the Toyota Sutsumi plant, so I saw how they assembled uh, the cars and how they welded the cars, which was done by robots, fully by robots. So it's very nice to see them. And I also saw a robot uh, playing a violin in the Toyota Kaikan Museum. And uh, other than that, in the award ceremony, we went to Mega Web. Uh, so the award ceremony, um, a lot. There were a lot of good artworks over there. So mm -hmm. one of them was the engineers. Uh, inspiration award that one uh, was a uh, note car it was about music it, the car played music mm. so that one uh, they uh, some people made a model of it in Toyota so it was very nice to see all those interesting drawings okay. and after that in mega web we also played a few fun games okay all right so I mean hearing from you um some people would want to enter this competition. Is there anything you would like other potential applicants to know about the DCAC? Something yes, you want to share with them? Like the dream car is not just about like drawing any car. You also have to think of a concept which will help. Uh, it's relate which is related to the society and environment's problems. So the car should be like it should help the society and environment. Okay, so and um, how are you going to con? like you know compete again do you want to compete again yes okay so um back um, to you charles um what does it take to win such a competition as in the artwork rules and the regulation you want to tell us something about that okay so adrisha pal actually um told you all about so i'll just take it in a summary form all you need to do is to be able to dream mm. as the name suggests the mm. theme of the the dream car arts contest is um your dream car so you dream and then you conceptualize stuff that have need attention within the society after conceptualizing that you need to actually solve the problem that society is facing and then make it colorful express it in an art form and um, what we don't want people to do is to present to us collaborative art forms mm -hmm. or arts that are digitally rendered okay so we don't also want um, you to bring us something that is not original for example the Mickey Mouse and the Frozen and then all that. That's from someone's own imagination. We yes. want children to harness the, the power of their own imagination and bring us something that is new and something that's fresh, something that has a fresh perspective on how they can change society and the world at large. Okay, so your final words. Okay, so we'd be expecting quite a number of children to participate in the 12th annual Dream Car Art Contest, which is opened from now to the 23rd of February. Mm. You can pick forms at the head office of Toyota Ghana. You could also call us and then we can also drop um, some forms in your school if you want your school to participate. Okay.